Brent Moore, not to be confused with Mitch, the bigger of the two. But first off, you, your brother goes out and gets a fall. You can't be one up by the sophomore baby brother. You come out and you get a fall. First, what did you hit him with, by the way? Uh, I call it a Big Mac. Um, my coach, Travis McIntosh, he's new to the staff this year. He showed it to me a couple of years ago when he was working Coach Jordan's camps. And uh, it's something that Coach Lang and Coach Jordan aren't exactly fans of, but it was there and we needed the points, so I had to go for it, really. So. They might be fans of it after today. Uh, I don't know. I could argue that. <laughs> But your brother comes out and he just fires the crowd up. He fires the whole team up. The momentum is going your guys' way. You're losing. You're trying to come from behind. What's going through your head? You get that first takedown. You guys are going for that front cow catcher a lot. Mm -hmm. Cement job, as Coach uh, Jordan calls it. But that front cow catcher where you catch the head, get the arm out, mm -hmm. and you can't get it. I just had to wear him out more. Um, I mean, going out, I knew I had one job to do, and that was to put up major team points. Um, I was I was looking big too early. The kid was still fresh. I had to wear him out a little bit, and I caught him in something slick and got the team points. Looking at this, uh, you guys did not have the best iron man. You were third. You know, I I had your quarterfinal match and guy hit with a couple of slick ducks, and you, you lost a tough quarterfinal to the OPR OPRF guy. Mm -hmm. And then what would you end up placing in Ironman? Third. Third. So you came back for mm -hmm. a tough third. That's a tough finish, man. Yeah. You know, and and what that guy end up taking the OPRF guy? He was in the fifth or sixth match. He was below know. you, right? I guess so. Not getting another shot at him, you know, and able to come out and get a little bit of redemption against Blair. You've never beaten Blair in your career here yeah. in a duel. How's that feel? Feels good. Um, that that was just icing on the cake. There's nothing more I wanted this year than to beat Blair. I Ever since last year, because me and Mitch both dropped tough matches in the Blair duel last year at Blair. So we really wanted that one back, and I think me and Mitch made a statement today. Looking at you guys, you, you chose Virginia Tech, right? Mm -hmm. You're going to Virginia Tech. You're a senior. Yep. State champ is a junior, and then were you were third? I was third my freshman year, second as a sophomore, first as a junior. So you worked right up the ladder. Yeah. So, you know, to win another state title, what would that mean to you here? Uh, that's that's just icing on the cake for me. That's all I need out of the end of this year. Um, I want I want the St. Ed's duel too, but I'm just looking at state and St. Ed's now. Uh, 132 for St. Ed's, who is it? 132, 138. 138. Hunter Ladner. So, so Ladner, he won the... Yeah. The Iron Man. Yeah. How, what that would that mean? Yeah, that's that like be, the one you wanted. Isn't yeah. It? I can't wait for that match. It'll be a good one. How so, hard do you guys train between here and that match? Very hard. We're St. Ed's Kings of the State, and that's what that duel is for. So we want St. Ed's, and we're going to come out and wrestle tough just like we did against Blair. Why Virginia Tech? Uh, I think I fit in really good with the mindset. They're not, they don't dance around. You know, they like to get in there, and they, they got good new coaches on staff with um, Zadik and St. Myers. St. John. St. John. God, that's, that was stupid. Maybe. I don't even know why I, you would say St. Myers. I, I don't know. But, but you know, Derek St. John, that guy's yeah. an NCAA yeah. champ. You know, Zadik's a three-time All-American, yeah, wor world coaches, silver medal, you know, that guy, they're really good. Yeah. Um, when you saw that, had you committed before that or after it? That was right after. So like right after, that's week, like, I think. Yeah, yeah, it's like icing on the cake yeah. for you, isn't it? Yeah. Um, looking at Coach Jordan, is he the best high school coach in the country? I, I believe so. Coach Jordan really pushes us to be the best we can be on and off the mat. And uh, everyone on the team owes everything to Coach Jordan. I couldn't thank him enough. All right, who's the best more brother? Uh, me. <laughs> you got anything else for me? No, no thanks. Hey, congratulations on thank the win you. today.